name is Zach and I like to backpack around the world. Good morning from Brownsville. I'm about to check out of my hotel here, but first I want to introduce you to someone that is also staying at this hotel. What's your name? Juanita Green. Hey, they call me Green from here, from Zena. I just want to send a shout out to my brother, MG Music, by self, with Self Made Cartel. And yes, from here, from Bronson, Texas. All right, good to meet you. Thank you. I'll see you. All I'll right. see you, Zach. See you when I come back to yes, Brownsville? Yes, All right. sir. God bless you. Thank you. Bye. Have a good night or a good day. And now I am off to Mexico. She saw my car magnets and she gave me a lot of love, so I had to include her in one of my videos. So thank you. And yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, M G. Hey, hey, look. We got strength in numbers. What? Ain't talking about the type to jump your bitch, me and my brothers. Check. We got that one hit, make you wonder, did he hit with thunder? Huh? Or did he kick me with his leg? No, bitch, he be swinging like a baseball Check. on your head. She be calling me the subway because I toast the water. And now I am checking out of my hotel. Oh, my hair looks, my hair looks so bad. Here you go. Right. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, 101. How was everything? Perfect. Uh, was the room okay? Yes. Any complaints? No. No. Nope. Good to go. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. Have a good day. And now I am on my way to park my car in a storage lot. And then I'll be taking a bus to Monterrey, Nuevo Leon, Mexico. I absolutely cannot wait. I've never been to Monterrey and I'm excited to check the city out. So. I am encouraging you to come backpacking with me. Vamanos. All right, I got everything squared away with storing my car here in Brownsville, Texas. I'm not gonna say where I'm storing my car. You can assume where if you want. I don't have anything valuable in my car. Everything valuable is with me, so I'm good there. I have insurance, so. I'm sure I'll be fine. They have cameras all over this place, so I should be good. Anyways, I'm about to grab a lift to the bus station here in Brazil. Then I have a layover in McAllen, Texas. And then I think I have another layover over the border, I believe. I'm not sure on that one.
from McAllen, Texas. Here I come, Monterey. Vamanos. Probably shouldn't show that room number since I'm going to upload this video tomorrow. Oh well. Anyways, let's go ahead and check out my room. Quick room tour. Nice chair. Very nice chair. Nice television. Let's check out the bathroom. Not bad. It'll do. It'll do its job. I will definitely enjoy this. I was originally going to be staying at an Airbnb. But the one that I booked on the Airbnb map, it was showing that it was centrally located in the downtown area of Monterey. And there was a lot of bars and restaurants and convenience stores nearby the Airbnb. And so I took a taxi from the bus station to this Airbnb. And as I was approaching it, like there was nothing around for two, three blocks, four blocks. I didn't see any bars, any restaurants, any OXOs, nothing. And I was like, um, I looked, I pulled out my iPhone and looked at the maps to see if I was in the Centro and I wasn't. So I'm hoping I can get a refund from Airbnb due to the inaccurate listing. Even in the guide for the Airbnb, it was saying, tell your taxi Uber driver, whatever that the address is this address but don't actually go to that address go to another one it was just weird anyway so i don't know he said look at the directions for your reservation to arrive important important always use the address i'm probably going to pronounce this wrong but privada tipiake number 902 for uber slash gps slash taxi the apartment is on the same street but in property number 916 gray house with black gate do not use number 916 as the address in uber slash gps slash taxi because sometimes it will give you the wrong address or a longer route so i'm assuming that the Privada to Pakiak number 916. Maybe that's in Centro and nearby all these restaurants and bars. And maybe that's why it showed me that's where it's at when it's not actually where it's at. Therefore, I would have never booked the Airbnb. So hopefully I can get a refund due to an inaccurate listing. Do you think Airbnb should give me a refund because they inaccurately put on their map well excuse me excuse me it's not airbnb's fault i think it's more so the host's fault do you think that airbnb should give me a refund due to the host having an inaccurate listing on their website i don't know Provecho. God damn, muy caliente. Well, I guess I'm going to call it a night. From here in Monterey, tomorrow I will go ahead and do the exploring that I want to do around the city center of Monterey. 
I got here pretty late around 10 p.m. so there wasn't much to do because everything's pretty much closed so but anyways yeah um, I guess I can do one more thing before I end this video a typical Zach backpacking around the world thing to do y'all know me by now cheers from Monterey Nuevo Leon Mexico Oh. Nothing like a Coca Cola in a new town. Buenas noches from Monterey.